Hey, welcome back everyone to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a short video on how you can take multiple pages from a PDF and save them into a completely separate file and just be able to separate the pages or print the pages or combine the pages that you want to um, that you want to print or save without having to do it to the entire PDF document. So let's go ahead and get started. You see here that I'm on Google. I'm gonna actually get off of here. I'm gonna go to my files. And I'm going to open up my PDF file. I am using Adobe Acrobat. And you see here that I have um, some of my curriculum and that it is 822 pages long. There's no way that my printer would be able to handle that amount of ink. So um, what I want to do is I just want to print off a math lesson. So see right here, math story problems edition. It's called Take a Hike. This theme is a camp, campy, camp camp theme so uh it's not actually telling us to go take a hike um so i'm gonna click right here here's the lesson plans for it so i don't i don't want any of that i just strictly want the materials for my students okay let me zoom in a little bit scoot the screen over perfect okay so right here, math story one, this is where it starts. And you notice that this is page 458 right here. So I'm gonna keep that number in my head, page 458. And I'm just gonna keep scrolling down, 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 down. Lots of good stuff. Okay, this one right here, this shows us how to do the activity. I don't want to put that in there. So I'm going to stop right here on page 465. So remember, I started with page 458, and I'm ending on page 465. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to File, Print, And then pages, I want page 458 through 465. And let's put this in color. And you'll see right here that it changed it. So we have page one of eight instead of um, 820 some odd pages. But anyway, for our printer right here, you'll see that my default printer is selected. I'm gonna click the drop down arrow and I'm gonna go to Microsoft Print to PDF. So it's gonna take what I would normally print and it's gonna save it as a PDF file. I'm gonna go ahead and click print down here. And it should, yeah, there it goes. It's gonna prompt me to save it. So I'm going to save this as, since this is gonna be my curriculum for summer school, I'm gonna do ESY, which stands for extended school year. Addition problems. And I'm just gonna put the year in case I have something saved like this from previous years. And uh, I want it as a PDF document. So I'm just gonna click save. And it's quote unquote printing as it saves this. Okay, it's done. I'm gonna go ahead and close this PDF so you can see the difference. And then right here I have ESY edition problems 2018. Double click, open it, and here we go. Just the pages that I wanted. And up here you can see, you know, page six out of eight. I get to the bottom and I'm done. So yeah, page eight out of eight. So that's how you do it. Really simple to be able to 
just pick and choose the pages that you want. Um, what I recommend is if you want to do multiple sets of pages, instead of having to repeat this process over and over, and you want to save it into one document, just write down the page numbers that you want to save. And then when you get to the printer page, uh, where it says pages, then you look at your note that you were taking and you just type in the page numbers that you want. So hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a like, subscribe to my channel. If you have any questions or if you um, want me to make any more tutorials or you, um, you know, want to see something else, please leave a comment down below. I look forward to hearing from you guys and thanks so much for stopping by. Have a great day.